Bryce is back playing Stranded Deep, your probably favorite thing on the face of the planet by now. Back here with Wally, some rocks, and some sticks. This time, I'm, I'm debating, because I don't want it to turn night while I'm gone from my campfire. But I kind of want to explore this stuff, because this island is blatantly useless. Like, there's physically nothing I can do here. Literally. It's that freaking shark. You want to go, bro? Let's go. I'm going to have shark tonight. Probably barbecued, because barbecue sauce is amazing. Ugh. Oh, it's a tiger shark. What happened to my black tip? Ugh. It just used scare tactic. It doesn't want to actually fight me. Yes, I've come to your turf. Come to my turf, huh? I bet you won't. Oh my god, it does attack. Okay, Jesus. That's probably not a good place to be. Okay, well, I think I'm bleeding. It is not a good start. Okay. Oh, Jesus! Ow, it chased me. Okay, I'm retreating, bro. Give me a break. No, Wally, save me. Please. Oh, God. Do I heal from this? I don't know. Do I have to, like, get medicine? How do I... What do I do? <laughs> Duct tape. Maybe I can... Like... Tape myself up. I can't tape myself up. Well, it was a valiant effort. I guess I'm just going to die of bleeding out. Let me grab Wally for the trip, I guess. I wish I could pick up my campfire. Okay. Probably going to go off in the raft and just see what I can find. What do I have with me? Okay, I'm going to drop the rock. Because I'm going to, if I go somewhere, I've got to be able to pick something up. Mark. Wow, my guy is considerably slower than he was earlier. Apparently a shark bite does that to you. <laughs> Crazy. Okay, I'm in the life raft and got my little paddle. Yes, I am king of the sea. Probably just uh, speed this up for you guys, because probably don't want to watch me for like five minutes sail across the ocean. It's probably not ideal. So see you on the other side. Okay, well, so while I was uh, kind of going across, I came across this lovely shark that hit my, uh... Is this a tiger shark and black tip? Nope, it's that tiger shark, and I'm screwed, everybody! Wally, no! This is for you, Wally! Uh. Okay, let's get out of here. It's turning nighttime. I'm in a freaking shark battle. This is not going well. I think if I'm going to drown... Oh, my God, there's another one. Oh! Uh oh! Get on the boat! Get on the boat! Make farting noises! Sail! <laughs> Please! I have a family of a volleyball and a coconut. Please! I have so much to live for. The possibility of new hopes on this island. Oh, he's underneath me! Oh, there he is! Oh! He's pushing me the wrong way! Oh! Oh, that's a long ways away. Oh, God. No, oh, there he is. On the raft, on the raft, on the raft. But, come on, I'm so close. This guy's a real jerk. Just because I decided to stab him in the face. Come on, it's been like a whole five minutes. Don't you have like horrible memory or something? That's a goldfish, whatever. Close enough, both fishes, right? No, oh my God. <laughs> Not even on the raft yet. I'm so close to the island. I can't leave the raft. It'll make travel like 10 times longer. Yeah, this is not. Oh, screw the raft. Yeah, I should have got the raft. This was a bad idea. This was a bad idea. 
No regrets? No regrets? <laughs> oh no. Just the thought of it behind me. Maybe it's still terrorizing the raft. Yeah, I'm really regretting leaving the raft behind. I feel like in 10 years I'm going to go back and the raft is going to be there like, You left me. <laughs> you monster. Left me for the sharks. Okay, I'm on land. The shark shouldn't be able to get me now. Maybe I can find a sweet volleyball friend to go with Wally here. No? Okay. Well, that was a valiant thought. I kind of wanted more than one friend. So what did I leave behind on that other island? Oh, no way. You know, I kind of feel bad, because, like, Wally isn't as special as I thought he was. <laughs> I've got two Wallys. <laughs> Is this, like... <laughs> Am I in the middle of a cult? If I walk upon like an alien infestation of wallies? Maybe every island I go to there's a wally and I just have to find it. Deep inside we're all a wally, am I right? Just a volleyball with hair. Wow, I wish I could find an island that was actually useful to me once. That would be amazing. Okay, let me see what this has over here. Can I use my lighter for light? No, because that'd be crazy. Why would I use that for light? Uh, okay, well, what's the boat? you think the water would be freezing, too. I mean, it's the middle of the night. No, my man shows no pain. Sweet, a compass. Now I can find my raft I left. It's probably that over there. I wish I had binoculars. they have binoculars in this game? I just don't know. Let me pull up the compass. It's something cool, I guess. North. If I keep going north, I'll eventually hit... Okay, if I knew where I was, I should be able to find civilization by following this compass. But to me, it just looks like a bunch of train of islands everywhere. There's an island over there, an island over there. You could really get lost. But wait! Not if you have a compass. I'm pretty set. Okay, so apparently these islands are just not working out for me. I've gotten a compass and some flippers that I forgot I had. Maybe that's why I'm swimming so fast. Eh. Climb Mount Olympus. I am. Jesus. Okay, so there's the moon. In relation to my compass, it is southeast. Which, to me, means nothing at all. So here's my dilemma. I know back on the island I have a whole campfire, which is five whole sticks. And some string and some rocks, which I'm, okay. Blatantly, I can find that probably on any island. I think I can move on to a new one. Problem is, I know my raft, and the frickin' shark followed me over here. <laughs> Get a life, bro. There's probably some other stranded guy on all these islands. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Okay, so I don't want to swim a whole ocean again. I mean, I feel like that island's kind of close. If I had a freaking life raft, I got the paddle for it. <laughs> freaking, uh, maybe I should go back. If the shark, this is a really conflicting game. It plays with your emotions in ways that you couldn't imagine. Okay, the shark is still pup- two of them are puppy guarding my raft. Okay. I'm just gonna make a- there's probably another shark on the way over there. I mean, it's probably the way this game works. I feel like that one's probably the closest island and not that one. So I can kind of see the shore on that one. Okay, I got two vol- I got two wallies. That's cool. <laughs> My life is devoted to them. And it, that one kind of looks close too. It's probably just an illusion. I'm probably going mentally insane. That's probably the one I came from actually. I'm gonna go to this one. Ah, oh, give me luck. Swim. Swim like you were deserted on an island and this was your only choice. I've got a paddle in my hand, that should help. 
Uh, I probably won't have to be able to use this. Oh my god, is that my raft? Am I going the wrong way immediately? Well, it's good thing I have my compass so I don't get lost, everybody. Yeah, if I won't be able to use this video, it's probably like 15 frames a second, but maybe it'll work. Maybe. It's really disappointing if it doesn't, because I have like it on the lowest settings possible, and if it still doesn't work, I'm screwed. Well, let's go to this island. I'm pretty sure it's the one I came from, considering my raft was in between it, but... You know, I'm making progress, at least. I've got a compass in a second volleyball. And I found my raft again. So not everything's bad when you're lost. Is that a shark? I can't tell. Some movement in the water. See, I didn't think they had the sharks programmed as enemies yet. I thought they were just entities. But no, apparently they are programmed into attack you as they bit my face off earlier. Ah, yes. The world loads as an island appears. Huzzah. This guy's probably got huge muscles on his arms. Like, the amount of activity I make him do. I should probably eat at some point, too. I don't know, it hasn't popped up and told me I was hungry. I think that's what it does. From my previous knowledge. I would hope so. Then I'm just starving to death and I don't know. How do you think you tell the time? There's an achievement on Steam. It's like, look at your watch, but I'm not sure how to look at my watch. Maybe I'll save that for the thrilling third installment, because I think I'm going to end it as soon as I get to this island, because I'd like to leave you guys on a massive cliffhanger. Is this my original island, or is it a new shiny island? You'll have to find out. Bum, bum, bum. Bum, na, na, na. Thanks for watching, everybody.